By the end of the night, I think we're gonna end up with just two girls. That's right, we're going five girls down to two. The Mormon Bachelor is back. And it feels like we've waited like a whole month for this, right? Because we have, and it's finally, finally here. I'm excited, this is my recap of episode four of The Mormon Bachelor, AKA Provo's Most Eligible, and let's get right into it. All right, in this episode, it features roller skating, and like practically every single girl now has a boyfriend. Okay, even the camera guy's on skates. It's not necessary, bro, just walk, it's not ice. What is even happening here? <laughs> so hard i'm doing something that i love and of course i'm gonna put all my might into it hey annalee thanks for dressing up that sublime shirt it really screams do me right here on this roller rink <laughs> whoa annalee is that a split that move has never been pulled out in provo before okay this is like really sad watch this poor guy who like thinks he's on fire stop drop and roll buddy oh he's dancing that's awkward, my bad. You guys here for the fish kiss experience? Yep. <laughs> All right. You'll come down Even this guy's wearing garments. Fish. Is everybody uh, Mormon in Provo? Okay, like I might get my account suspended for this, but watch this clip. This is literally Colin losing his virginity. Oh no. <laughs> it's so weird. <laughs> it's weird to see. Yeah, I... Be strong, be strong, Colin. I cannot believe they're showing this. Oh. Oh, he just has fish sucking on his feet. What? Is Colin growing a mustache? Bro, you look like Ricky Ricardo. All right, check it out. Our host Remington delivers an absolute backbreaker to Colin in the most nonchalant way ever. So I have some bad news for you. I don't know if you've heard or not, but some of the girls tonight, they do have boyfriends. Once again, things that could have been brought to my attention yesterday! You know, I was, gonna, I was hoping they were going to be loyal and everything, but... You thought they were going to be loyal. Colin, you've kissed one girl this entire time. You haven't shot an episode in over a month. I'm just trying to, like, think of how to phrase it and be like... Like, it hasn't been the whole time. Like, I don't... Like, even though it has been, I don't want to be like... The lies! There you the go, lies, this bitch! The lies. Telling. It would be unfair if I didn't tell you that I do have a boyfriend. Okay, I called this. Who remembers this? But no, they're... That's not the significance of it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Did you notice that? She almost said, no, there's not somebody else, but she stopped herself. Watch it again, but bet this girl has another dude. But I, I actually don't kiss a lot of girls. Like, I'm not okay. that kind of person. You know, you know. The no, 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 no. I, I'm All right. For all you non Mormons out there, a Nikmo is a non committal makeout. It's like a Mormon one night stand. <laughs> I'm on the stage where I'm ready to get married. So if I find the right guy, I'm ready. You're ready? You're like 18. I don't understand how someone says I'm ready for marriage, but they like don't have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. How are you ready? You're a great guy. You're really amazing. I just don't know if I can see this going anywhere. Really? So, okay. yeah. Wait, so the most awkward first kiss of all time meant nothing to you? All right, here it is, my pick for cringiest moment of the whole episode, right now. <laughs> what the hell was that, Colin? Okay, so don't see ya. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Hey, never ever do that goodbye. Ever. <laughs> uh, yeah, quick question. When will the fantasy suites be held? All right. There they are, our final two. Elena, the British chick. She received the first impression rose the first night. And Anna Lee, she was the chick that was involved in the mosh pit accident. <laughs> but unfortunately, I did get trampled in a mosh pit last night. <laughs> Still one of my favorite clips from this damn show. All right, I'll see you next time with the finale.